this. Um, sorry, it's kind of dark in here. I just want to talk about uh, something or other. <laughs> wow. Uh, I'm guessing by the title you're probably unsure what the hell that's about. Okay, well, um, basically there is a, uh, there's this, this person who um, has got sock puppet accounts. Um, when I say sock puppet accounts, I mean various accounts. There is Anon Storm, there is Truth Seeker Beering, sorry, Beer Being, there was Ronnie Pickering, uh, there's now Ernie and Bernie, and now we got, and then, sorry, not, and then we've got Anon Storm. All, all the same fucking moron, you know, all the same idiot. So he puts up a video, um, first of all, against um, EVP Paranormal Science, which is interesting. Apparently, he hypnotizes people to watch his videos. Okay. And uh, he, um, what's the other thing he does? Oh, yeah, he has a CB radio, uh, which is how his ghost box sessions work. <laughs> <sighs> no, um, no, 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 no. He doesn't use a CB radio to get his ghost sessions to work. I'm pre pretty sure of that. If he was gonna falsify his sessions, okay. So that's the first one. Um, the interesting one is what has come up with EVP Paranormal Science is his views and his subs. People are like, "Wow, you got a lot of views and a lot of subs. Are you sure you're not buying these?" So I had to do a little research because I thought, well, "If that is happening, I've got to deal with that," you know. So I had a look at his, um, you know, whatnot, and I looked at the price. Um, you, if you want them cheap, you got to hunt around. But if you don't hunt around, it's quite it's more expensive than I thought it would be to get views and subs. Anyway, regarding views and subs, it works like this. Okay, if you get ghost subs or empty subs, like what Huff has got, because if you notice, Huff's got one hundred thirty-three thousand subs, but his views don't go anywhere near his sub count. If that makes sense, nowhere near. I mean, okay, my sub count's like 115, we'll say, 1,015 at the moment, but I usually get about 400 views, 500 views, and what that's at least nearly 50%, you know, but Huff gets like 6%, 5%, really low numbers, unless it's like a certain video, like the Robin Williams, he had a million views, and this is what I'm going to come up to in a sec. Um, so yeah, basically, you've got... Um, you know, is he buying his views and his, his uh, subs? Well, if you buy subs... YouTube won't do you for that, so say, uh, especially if they're inactive, because, well, <laughs> how to describe this, the thing that fucks you over is if you are monetized on YouTube, right, and you buy your views, that is where your revenue comes from, your views, not your subs, does that make sense, no matter how many subs you got, your revenue and your money comes from views on the adverts, so if Scotty bought his, um, views he'd be in a lot of trouble with youtube it would suspend his account he wouldn't be allowed to make money for six months or a year i can't remember which and various things mods but one thing that did come up is well maybe he clickbaited yeah he probably did clickbait and he tagged as well um he didn't just tag brian's name he didn't just tag uh his own name he tagged my name in there he tagged every fucking name in there going mm, is that ethical is that right i don't know it's, it's, you can call it cheating, right? I don't tag my stuff full stop, I just upload it as it is, I don't put a tag on mine, um, so I don't know, there's, there's debate to be had there, you know, clickbaiting, you know, is it ethical, is it not, I say, personally, that's a personal thing down to the channel, because if you clickbait all the time, people will come to realise it, and they'll leave you, and that's up to the person themselves, do you know what I'm saying, that's not something I can really say, just because I don't do it doesn't mean you shouldn't do it, but as for buying subs and views, I don't think he's buying views because um, his account would be suspended. Not so much the subs, but the accounts. But he did. I remember him giving the phone call, uh, a phone conversation to me um, a little while ago. He said that suddenly his subs are going up like through the roof, and he doesn't know why, and he was really worried about it. This is way before. This was like what we're talking. September last year, I think this was, something like that. He did say to me, you know, I don't know what's going on. I said, oh, just relax, just enjoy it, you know, if it's going up through the roof, great. I mean, you already had, like, uh, 10,000, 7,000 between that area in the first place. And he phoned me again, you know, it's going up, like, you know, in a week's time. He said, it's gone up to, like, 15,000 now. I don't really get this. Is someone sabotaging me? Is, you know, I'm worried there's going to be repercussions from this. I was like, well, how can there be? I said, go to your email and have a look, see who's subbing you. Yeah, they're all there. They're, they're real profiles. They're real people. I click on them and I check them. And each one seems to be, you know, somebody, so I, I don't know. 
But he did raise that bar, but no, maybe not. But like I said, he has tags and he's clickbait the fuck. And as for his other videos, he has got other videos with massive views. He probably didn't tag mine so well, the Chloe video, because um, it's got less views. One of them got a really good one, but the other one not so. And plus, I'm probably not as popular. Anyway, the main reason for this video is not that as such. That's just one thing I wanted to address. The main thing I wanted to address was, as you probably read by the title, and going back to the sock puppet thing, is this uh, person put out several videos. Um, two of them were just strange. They were Frankie Boyle. <laughs> He's got very controversial <laughs> comedy, but okay. Uh, and, um, you know, in the description, it was stating the truth seeker saying, oh, yeah, whatever. That's fine. And it said Elvis Presley has been found in Truth Seekers group and it had an Elvis impersonator playing the guitar. Okay then, that makes more sense. Then we had the Scotty EVP Paranormal Science video saying that he hypnotises people and, um, you know, he buys his subs and he uh, also uses a CB radio to get good contact. But that, that's what he does, he uses a CB radio. CB radio doesn't even interfere with FM, dumbass. But anyway, next thing. Um, I used to have a CB radio, so I know that. Uh, oh yeah, the final thing, the thing I actually wanted to talk about, and I keep forgetting, yeah, it's kind of important, he put up a video about me, and this was his downfall, I'm fucking right. He put up a video, first of all, leaking my address and putting photos. He basically called for all Muslims to come and find me, bear in mind put my address up, and behead me. Wow, that's kind of interesting, isn't it? You know, whatever agenda you have, whatever, um community thing ideology you support and no matter how much you don't like someone would you really want them dead thinking about how would you really want them to be beheaded and killed hmm a lot of hatred there like over the top i think someone needs to go see a psychiatrist and just sort of sort their head out i mean really all this because i mean you know it's like you're waiting for it i mean okay so i have my views on islam i certainly have not Muslims, Islam, and maybe I should be a bit more, you know, um, you know, forthcoming with that. But those are my views, those are my opinions. I live in a country of free speech, and I haven't directly, because he put, I've insulted the Prophet Muhammad. I don't agree with the Prophet Muhammad, but I haven't sat there and insulted him and, I don't know, called him names. But it comes to something when someone can make a cartoon of him and, you know, they're going to be killed for it. Eh, people, you know, people make cartoons of Jesus, but hey, you know. And it does say in that Quran, um, <laughs> oh, I'm not going to give you verses and details and all the rest of it, but basically, if 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 you're a non-believer, you're an infidel, and you you do need to be slayed, you know. But that's my opinion. I I what I want people to do. Don't follow my opinion. What I want you to do is research it yourself if you're interested in that kind of thing. Okay. Um, if you don't have an opinion on it, that's even better. You know, obliviousness to this sort of thing is probably a good thing, especially as such a touching subject. Um. But wow, you know, to, to to have to call to have me beheaded is is kind of interesting. That really says a lot about that person and, and their mind themselves. You know, they they've been saying things like "you're an empty head" and all this. They've said all sorts of abhorrent things. And you probably noticed them on the comments here and there. And I just delete. I don't reply to them because it's just there's no point replying because it's, they're not there for debate. They're not there to, you know, be swayed. They're they're just a troll. And trust me, they don't. Um, think any better of Brian Holloway either believe me on that one they don't believe in the spirit box or, or apps you're all crazy people who use them okay that's you know one thing but um, yeah such a hatred towards me to, to, to want me killed what, what about my daughter what about my wife what about my family that probably didn't even enter their head you know not at all not at all I mean, I don't know if they thought they were trying to be funny or something but to, you know it, they meant it because they leaked my address too so what are the repercussions of this stupid video? Well, Anon Storm does not exist no more. YouTube has terminated the account. I'm fucking right. Well done, YouTube. And I just want to say, Anon Storm, I just want to say one little thing to you. Hey, moron! Fucking moron! Idiot.